When you travel to Antarctica, you expect to see icebergs, glaciers, and breathtaking vistas. But what you might not be expecting is the incredible wildlife. While cruising in the Antarctic Sound, we spotted three whales fishing together. Our captain pulled up alongside them so that we could get a close view. The whales put out what is called a bubble net, which is a natural phenomenon in which the whale blows air into the water, creating what looks like bubbles around them. That's the green you see in the picture. The fish think they're in a net and don't move, allowing the whales to eat them. These were humpback whales, and we were able to observe them until they swam off together to fish elsewhere. Another creature we saw everywhere was penguins. They swam alongside our ship, jumping out of the water like fish. We also saw them floating by on icebergs. And we got up close and personal with them on the Falkland Islands. They live out in the open on private farms in what are called rookeries in the Falklands. There's a rope on the ground around the rookeries so that people don't go inside, but there's nothing that keeps the penguins from coming outside. And they did. In fact, they got close enough to touch. Most of the penguins were Gen 2, but there were a few king penguins, the more colorful ones in the middle, that had a three-day-old baby they were protecting. Penguins don't see people as predators and thus have no fear. It was an all-time great experience getting nose to beak with penguins. Other animals you'll encounter in Antarctica include seals and birds, but not much else can survive in the frigid weather. The world's southernmost continent is beautiful in the most startling way, with colorful glaciers, amazingly crystal blue waters, and a clear sky like nowhere else on Earth. A trip to the frozen continent is definitely worth the journey.